Shoo! How's it going, folks? Welcome back to another episode. Today, we've got something very special to plan. we got a really exciting raccoon trapping adventure. We are going to be going to the local fast food joints around here and getting, well, we're going to ask the employees what they think a raccoon would like, and then we're going to get that item, and we're going to stick them in a live trap with trail camera so you guys can see the raccoons go in there, and we're going to have a competition between myself, Bonzo, and John to see who can catch a raccoon the fastest. But we're starting off the day at Orshland Farm and Home. Shout out to those guys. Not really. They don't sponsor anything, but I guess shout out to those guys for no reason. Anyways, we are going to be, we got to just restock on some stuff. We got to restock on chicken feed and a couple other items for the farm. And then we're going to be going to the fast food joints and uh, we'll hopefully get some lunch. I'm kind of hungry actually. And then we're going to be getting some food for the raccoons. You guys stay tuned. Can I get a chew? Chew! Oh, that's actually pretty good. I'm pretty impressed. I made Rackley do that the other really? day. I said, Rackley, give me a, give me a shoe. Shoe! No one can beat Juan Carlos. No, nobody can beat Juan. Juan, Senior Bass, Juan Carlos, hands down the best. Shoe! Because I jump out and I go, shoe! Or sheesh! Or shee hee hee! Something like that. Juan literally just goes, shoo! <laughs> like that. It's the best. Literally the best. Anyways, we gotta go get some chicken supplies. This is the good stuff. Because it has a turkey and a duck and a chicken, which are the three animals that I have to feed. So let's, uh, let's go beefcake mode, Bonzo. Let's grab, grab a couple bags. You wanna throw another bag on my shoulder? Ugh. Another one? All right, can you take the, can you take the other one? Yeah, before my, before my shoulder goes out. All right, we got the goods. Shoo! Well, that was a really exciting intro, guys. Glad I brought you along for that adventure. All we needed was chicken food. I thought we actually needed more. And I got in there and realized we don't really need any more. So we're headed off. We're gonna do some uh, grocery shopping. What are you, what are you vibing on? Kind of, here are our options. We have, is there a McDonald's in this town? Yeah. McDonald's. Burger King. Burger King. Runza. Taco Juan's. They don't, probably don't know what Runza is. Probably don't know what Runza is. Runza's a pretty, pretty dank place here in Nebraska. Got started here in Nebraska. Arby's. Dairy Queen. Subway. Subway. Oh yeah, Taco Bell. That's about it. That's about it though. What do you buy? I'll let you pick first, Junior. Or oh. do you want a roulette? Nah, let's just pick. I want a fish sandwich. So where do you get that? Burger King or McDonald's? McDonald's? McDonald's. McDonald's would probably be it. I think I'm gonna go McDonald's. I might give them some fries. Some fries and a fish sandwich is what you're vibing on. I'm thinking, I think Burger King would might have something too. I like your fish sandwich idea, but I might just go straight Whopper mode. I'm not really sure. I, I'm gonna go Burger King though. We're actually, I'm gonna go Burger King and I'm gonna buy whatever the person suggests for raccoon. Oh, you're I'm gonna, gonna ask I'm them. gonna ask them, hey, I'm trying to trap a raccoon. What would you suggest? And I'm gonna get whatever they want. What are you vibing on, Rick? Taco Juan's? You think that you think they're gonna like Taco Juan's? I like Taco John's. So. <laughs> Dude, they're gonna. Where are they gonna go to their bathroom? They're, your cage is gonna be filled with poop, bro. True. Are you gonna get a like a cup of potato lays honestly wouldn't look that bad to a raccoon. Okay, so we're gonna start here at Taco Juan's, and then we're gonna venture on down to BK and then McDonald's, and we're gonna see. We're gonna see what happens. You guys stay tuned. Ooh. Hey guys, change of plans. Taco Wands was out of commission, so we're starting off with Bonzo's place, and John's gonna have to pick a new spot. Do you wanna let them pick, or are you doing fish sandwich? Or do you wanna order a fish sandwich and then ask them what they think? Yeah, yeah, so we yeah. could double it up, yeah. maybe? Oh, uh, hi there, how's it going? Um, Do you guys have a fish sandwich? Excuse me? Ma'am? Is that fish fly, you mean? Or am, is it still not able to hear me? Oh, sorry, I can hear you now. Um, Yeah, do you guys have a fish fillet sandwich? Yes, we do. Okay, can I please get that, just the sandwich? Okay. Um, and then, if you were to go trap raccoons, what would you think uh, they would like to eat? Uh, I've never tracked raccoons before. I would think maybe chicken of some sort, or uh, beef, I don't know. Chicken or beef. Okay, um, why don't you just go ahead and surprise me with something on the menu, and we're going to try it uh, to trap a raccoon. Okay. Meat. To meat. Does that work? Yeah, what, what is that exactly? Uh, it's just regular meat patties. Oh, it's just the patties? Mm hmm. Oh. Hey, that could be a move. All right, yeah, that sounds good. What? What is that strat? She just gave me two meat patties. You ever, you ever heard of that? Like, no. no bun, no burger. Literally took meat, like a patty of meat, that's and that's so what weird. they're selling us. It just said two meats. Yeah, it was like, where did you see that? It was on the menu? Yeah, on, on their, like, the their little th thing. It said, like, fit o fish au filet or whatever it was. And then it was two meats. And I was like, what is that? She goes, it's two meat patties. <laughs> did you know you could just order straight meat patties? No one does that. No one does that. Hi there. Thank you. So is the raccoon, like, a house problem, or? Yeah, just, you know, pest control and stuff. And we're having a hard time catching them, so we figured uh, try some different fast food places, you know? Okay. But you're thinking meat's the deal? I would think so. I mean, I don't think that they go too much for bread. I'm pretty sure that 
they're scavengers though. Yeah, I would think so too. So, oh, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Dude, she's definitely dialed on the raccoons though. She knew they were scavengers, man. She knew they were a house problem. They've sca like scavengers, like a perk they use. You know, they also use ninja. They're pretty. They're pretty quiet. Slide a hand, dude. They got. They, have, they can. Uh -huh. you know, all you cod fans know what's up. Thank you very much. So what's this, bro? Literally, just two, two nasty. Well, look at this. Look at that one. Oh, they even got the tartar sauce. Think you think raccoons are big tartar sauce guys? Um, you wanna try the fish? Ooh. No, I actually I don't. But dude, who who actually orders two meat patties? Well, this is bon this is gonna be Bonzo's trap. You taking a bite? Nope. I would rather eat muskrat, bro. That's not good. Is it really that bad? Alright, we'll put this back in here. I'm gonna go try to find Burger King and then John's gonna have to find a new spot. Hi, how may I help you? Yeah, hi there. Do you oh you guys do have a big fish sandwich. Um, cool. Let me get a big fish sandwich, just the sandwich, please. Let's see. If you were to trap raccoons and use something from your guys' menu as bait, what would you suggest? I don't think we've ever been asked that before. What do raccoons like to eat? I don't, I don't know. Um, honestly, I don't know either. Um, maybe I, just like a regular dollar hamburger, maybe? I don't, I don't know. Yeah, no, that could definitely that could definitely work. Um, I, I'm honestly not sure what they eat. I, I was hoping you guys would know. Yeah, I'm not sure. I never trapped raccoons before. I mean, the most I've ever done is maybe shot a deer before but how big was the deer oh i don't remember that was quite a bit of time ago oh, I was I... like 13. oh i got you okay um you thinking you thinking just a, a regular cheeseburger then yeah maybe okay yeah I'll, I'll go with your advice then that sounds good we'll try that all right that'll be 568 we'll see you at the window okay thank, sir thank you buddy was telling me a story about his deer hunting adventures when he was 13. bro you got like the same thing as me well maybe they're fans of bk you know what i mean mine has bread though thank you very much have a good one that's the, that's a standard cheeseburger, ain't it? Yeah, it smells about like I would think. And then the uh, why don't you give that in a box real quick? Give that give that a dangle. Maybe you should taste test. Yeah, it. I'll taste test and see which one's better. I, I mean that one that one look looks bad. a little better. I'll just take a little piece. Steamy meat in the mouth. No one can. Wow, that's way better. Much. Really? You think raccoons are gonna think think that one's better too? I mean, it's kind of it's probably a good thing that we pick similar things because you can tell like which yeah. ones the raccoon actually like better. You know? All right, well two down. Johnny's up. Johnny's thinking Wendy's, and uh, Wendy's actually sounds good for lunch because I'm actually hungry. Um, so I'm not opposed to it. We're gonna go to Wendy's and see what they've got. See what they recommend to trap a raccoon. You guys stay tuned. Hi, welcome to Wendy's. I'll be with you in just one second. Sounds good. Do you want? Do you want me to ask for their suggestion, or do you got someone in mind? Um, we should get something sweet for sure, just to mix it up. Should then, we just ask them what they want, or do you have something in mind? I was gonna say the Baconator, just because like, everybody knows okay. what Baconator is. All right, all right. You think raccoons like Baconator? I don't know, I think you should ask them. It's kind of funny. Uh, kind of an odd question for you, but uh, I'm on a raccoon trapping adventure and I need to get food for my traps. Is there anything that you would suggest? Uh, meat patties? Meat patties. Just just, yeah. just plain meat patties, is that, is that what you're thinking? I mean, we could put cheese, cheese on them if you want. Yeah, I think raccoons like cheese. Bacon. All right. They, I think they're, they're, they might like bacon too. Do you got that? Yes, we do. All right, let's throw some <laughs> bacon on there then. Um, right. And Good then food. lastly, can I get two fresh baked cookies? I'll be around 13 minutes. Is that okay? Oh, wow. Uh, how about a Frosty? Okay. You got those on tap? Yes. Okay, perfect. Let's All just right. do a small chocolate Frosty then. Okay. Uh, how many meat patties would you like? Three. Three? Yeah. All right. Would that be all? Yep, that's it. 13 minutes for some fresh baked. Fresh baked? Yeah. They, they weren't lying when they said fresh baked, but I ain't got time for that, I so I got wait. a Frosty. You would have waited? Yeah. I wanted one. I know. That's why I ordered two. I wanted one. <laughs> you, ever, you ever ate in Raccoon? Huh? Have you ever eaten it? Raccoon? No, me neither. Yeah, but that's what his dad had. He had the dogs that... Yeah, had... put them in the trees, and then they'd, oh, then they'd yeah, shoot them. Oh, yeah. Things. Yeah, they're vicious. Oh, yeah. Yep, have a good one. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, we got more coming. Coming in hot, thank you. Got the freaking good, son. What's this strap? Oh, this is just this is just straight meat patties? Yeah. Oh, dude, I think John John might take the dub on this. Oh my gosh, you're uh, telling me a raccoon ain't gonna eat that? Wow. That's a triple stack. That's for beefcakes only. Anyways, how's it going, folks? We got all the goods. We are now headed to the farm. Shoo! All right, we are down at the farm. We are ready to rock and roll here, folks. We've got all the goods. We've got the Wendy's. We've got the McDonald's and Burger King. We got two fish sandwiches, some beef patties, and then a cheeseburger, and then more beef patties. Everybody thought that beef patties were the strat. So maybe they are. Maybe they know something we don't. We're gonna get loaded up here. Well, actually, first we gotta go do something. We gotta go check on uh, muskrat traps.
house before we do that. Um, we haven't checked on them since well yesterday, but we're gonna go. We're gonna pull them all since it's kind of like the last warm day. We're gonna pull them all out. It could be frozen right now. We could have a couple muskrats um, from last night because I'm not sure if it froze last night, but if it did, we probably don't have too many. But we're gonna try to pull all of the muskrat traps out, and then we're gonna go set all the raccoon traps out. You guys stay tuned. We almost made it. <laughs> so as you can tell, the ice is a, little, is a wee bit thick here, boys. We're going through like two and a half, three inches of ice with this freaking beast. We were on it for a second and then the whole thing just collapsed. <laughs> We got one finally. This is the same trap we got the yeah. one for the catching quick. You actually get him in a foot this time? Uh, yeah, we got him. In the, we got him in a foot. Is this your second or third cousin? Are we eating this one? Oh uh, no. No, not not a catching cook today. A little scrat. Not a bad scrat, Daddy. We had a hell of a freeze last night. I didn't think. I mean, I knew it got cold last night. I didn't think it got this freeze. But uh, it packed on the ice pretty darn good. Well, that's the last of them. The last one again. We gotta go set these raccoon traps now. Our our food's starting to get cold. Wonder if the frosty melted. <laughs> uh oh, probably should take that out of the car. Shoo! All right, we made it to. This is what we're gonna do. This is the shop. We've uh, we've actually got a couple raccoons in here. Not too many, but well, the reason why I like this spot is because it creates a shelter. It's a big wind block for anything that wants to come meander in here, take a gander in here. So we're gonna get set up. We've got everybody's food basically ready to rock and roll. I would say we put them, spread them out. Like put them, I'd say put one over there since we've got one over there. Don't put one there. One there, one here. And actually you can use this to disguise it too. That's also another strat that you could do. Maybe one down, down yonder. So we're gonna get started. All right, I'll go first, I guess. Put mine right down here. Get, get some Burger King. We're gonna get this guy situated here. There we go. It's nice and set. Gotta put the food in the back, I guess. Yeah, let's do the fish. Go. Fish fillet. God dang, that just does not, just just does not seem appealing. We're gonna do one of them. And I'll leave, the, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave the garbage out, the wrappers, not to litter, but just to bring some attractant. And we just got a regular cheeseburger. So they got, they got two options. If, they, if they're a big fish guy or a big beef guy, which we all know that ain't beef, uh, that might get them. But yeah, like I said, I'm gonna leave, leave the wrappers out, something that has some good scent to it um, and visual eye appeal as well. So we're gonna go ahead and shut up shop here with this guy. Back through there, perfect. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna put mine, I think the strategy is going to be about like this. Kind of up against this a little bit just to kind of make it look like there's some junk and then so take some wrappers and throw the wrappers out in front. Whatever, God knows what this thing is. I'm just gonna sit that on top. Just to kind of camo, camouflage it in. Make it look like a junk pile and that there's some food in here. Some satellite, looks like. Just kind of do that. I think that'll help kind of disguise it. Like I so said, put the wrappers. Maybe even throw a wrapper inside there, like a trail, like that. And then they're gonna walk around. They'll be sniffing, crawling, jumping on it. And they're gonna see the cheeseburgers, they're gonna try to reach around there. Ah, I can't get in there. And they're gonna go around, boom, right inside. It's gonna happen. So we're gonna put a camera on this one. Next up is Bonzo. Give me that fish. You want that fish fillet? Yeah. I'm gonna give him a freebie. Nice. Really? A nice little really bun. Maybe That's they're big bread guys. What are you gonna do with these two meat patties? You're gonna use some, the meat of some chum? Yo. You can put a bunch back there. Oh. And then, yeah, I would shove it under that. Oh, oh that's a good go. set, boys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Some meat right here. So we've got some chummage. Oh, that's a good set. They definitely aren't going to suspect Big anything. McDonald's, guys. Oh, yeah. All right, McDonald's is down. Now we've got Wendy's. What's the strat here, Junior? I don't know. I'm seeing a lot of tracks right here. There's so. actually a lot of tracks here, yeah. I'm thinking somewhere over this area. I, I would put it up against it like that's not a bad idea. Kind of like blends that. it in. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Kind of blends it in. All right, food go. Dude, that Ooh. looks so good. That looks. It that looks, looks good. That looks fresh. All right. Skirt. Yeah. Wow, that smell. That that. See, the bacon could be a strat because the bacon's very strong smelling. Do you what do you, what do you think about putting the frosty as the like, bait? Yeah, that's yeah. what I was gonna do. So they'll sit there that's and be like, we'll be sitting there like, mm -hmm. kind of a freebie. <laughs> All right, frosty going in. Frosty. Going. That's the old freebie, huh? 
Yeah, we'll just, we'll just give her a dangle there. Looks good. The, the white cup has some good eye appeal, too. True. Oh my god. I'm dead. Don't grab me. I'm trying to grab your dick. I missed. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> my boot's gone. Help. Bruh. Dad. Dad. Oh my god. Dad. What Dad. is going on in here? Dad. Dude, I got murked. <laughs> I thought, for some reason, I was thinking I was wearing waders, so I just tried to pull out of it. Never a good idea to pull out. Oh, okay. I feel like it, everyone's got that old grandpa that like still drives a car, but definitely shouldn't. That's a liability. That's you. I feel like that guy right now, just liability. All right, we're good. We got all three set up. We'll come back tomorrow and see how they do. I'm excited. So we're going to throw some cameras on it. Hopefully they work. Hopefully we catch big chungus. Shoo! How's it going, folks? Welcome back. It is the next day. It's time to check on damn traps. As you guys saw, we put a bunch of fast food in it, in the different traps, and it's me, Bonzo, and John. John could not be with us today, um, but Bonzo and I are here, and we're here to check on the traps, see who got raccoons, if any, and if we got any trail cam footage of it. You guys stay tuned. Oh, snap. I see one. I see two. Yes. You got one, Bob. He's the only one that didn't get one. He's not even here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. there's a fish sandwiches. Oh, true. What, what did John use? Frosty. <laughs> oh yeah. No, he used bur burgers and frosty, yeah, like yeah. baconators. I think yeah. it was. Yeah, it was a fish. I got one. You guys can see him. He's just. He must be sleeping. He's dangling in the corner. Bounces. How big? That, dude, that thing's a beefcake. Now that I look at yeah, it. Yeah. What's your What's your guy look like? Oh yeah, he's just a little guy. Not that big. I don't. I try not to show like close-ups because not gonna lie, raccoons are kind of cute, and I know you guys might get a little bit sad if. You know, I show their little puppy dog eyes and stuff like that, but we got two. Hopefully the trail cameras worked. We had trail cameras on them last night, but John's got murked. Look at his frosties knocked over, but nothing's, look at all these raccoon tracks, bro. All these burgers, they look eaten. Oh, it looks like mice. There's like little chunks missing out of it, but his trap is still up. So John, he's not even here to make fun of, dang it. Piss. I was hoping you didn't get one. I can make fun of you, but Dang. now we gotta make fun of John off camera. That's no fun. But we'll just look at John's footage and just see what, what did, did he get one to investigate is the thing. Because we got, me and Bonzo got them down on the ground uh, with the fish sandwiches. But John, <sighs> nothing like this frosty. So that's it. Let's look at the footy. All right, moment of truth. It was, in fact, on. Let's see how many clips we got. We've got 109. That's a lot. That means something was here. Oh, oh, what's that strat? Hold up. Oh, these might be mice. Oh God, yeah, mice. Bro, those are rats. Oh my God, these things are massive. Oh, they're on top. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that, but that's a kager. That is an absolute kager of a mouse. So I'm gonna keep going through, keep going through these clips. Mice, that's what I thought. Based off his burger, it looked like mice. I'm just gonna skip through until I see big chungus. Mice, more mice. Oh, bro, the the mouse is in his frosty. Grab that frosty out of there. Is there any mouse poop in there or something? Dude, they're they're dangling in the frosty, like literally sitting in the frosty cup right now. Oh, the frosty's gone. Yeah, they it. ate it. Oh God, yeah, that's mouse poop, boys. Really? Sheesh. Oh, that's nasty, bro. Here. You want the frosty now? Literally just straight mice. That's all that was on there. Straight mice. So if you guys are trying to catch some mice, which if you want to see those videos get brought back, you let me know. We need to be on that frosty grind. Anyways, nothing on John's camera. I hope my camera worked. I mean, we obviously caught one, but we're going to see if it got any of the footage if there was maybe more than one. All right. Moment of truth, boys. No, nope, it was on. And none of which are at night, and they're all of us setting them out. Rip. That camera didn't work. Perfect. We're gonna check on Bonzos. I mean, we got one. I mean, that's all that really matters. The camera was just for, the camera was just in case we didn't catch one, we could see who's attracting the most attention, which obviously was Bonzos and I, and, and John got the, the mouse strat dialed, but. All right, last camera. Check out the footy. We've got eight. Nope, nope. Oh, yep, that's me setting it out. That looks pretty cute. And nothing. Perfect. The two that actually caught one got none of the footage, but yet the one that didn't catch one got mice. I don't understand that strat. I'll have to call my boy Kendall Gray and ask him what the strat is on these cameras. Uh, maybe I'm probably messing it up because he seems to have good luck with them. I am just, I just am challenged when it comes to stuff like this. But anyways, nothing on that. We've got one raccoon, two raccoon. We're gonna go ahead and dispatch these guys. And uh, that's about it. Buddy, you were cheeks. What do you mean? Your trap sucks. Did you guys get any? Yeah, we got two. You got two? We got no, he got one and I got one. Bro, I'm not Chris. What do you oh, mean? Oh, man. You got mice, bro. Hella mice. Oh, like rats. Like oh. your favorite. Like big ones? Like keggers. Oh, frost. Yeah, the frosty, frosty was gone. Oh, just gone. And it just had like rat poop in it. But your camera was the only one that worked. Literally ours had something. nothing. No, it's not actually oh, worth oh, anything. Okay. We we came to the conclusion it was the fish sandwiches. 
because you didn't have you were the only one that didn't have fish sandwich so you guys are trying to catch raccoons you gotta listen you gotta listen to us not the workers because all the workers thought it was just meat which you were you had just meat just meat and it was straight cheeks is what it was, it was straight cheeks. meat straight cheeks. Meat cheeks fish sandwich fish sandwich victory anyways how's it going folks uh we're back at the house in case you were wondering and i gotta wrap this video up we just had to let we said inform john right here buddy here that he sucks said so we couldn't make fun of him while we were there kind of disappointed in that but now we're letting him know anyways hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you guys like the raccoon trapping videos let me know in the comment section down below and let us know what we should do next thank you so much for watching and peace